Hi guys, well I know this is a stupid time to do this list, but I'm going to do my top 5 movies of 2012. Um, there were some movies that I couldn't see in the cinema um, in 2012, but I now have them so I can do this list. So yeah, let's get started. At number 5 is The Muppets. I saw it two times in the cinema. First time was scared, second time was because of... Um, Miss Poogie there, and but yeah, I have the Blu ray, um, fantastic movie, it's a really great movie, definitely check it out. Um, and it's this there, yeah, I definitely recommend you pick up the Muppets, um, great film. Number four is, um, everybody, well, um, most people in the world loved it. Um, some didn't, but oh, I'm one of the people who did love it, and it's Ted. Um, very nice still book. Um, it, it's got the comedy that you expect from Seth MacFarlane. Um, it's got the comedy that you expect. Um, and I'm... I, I was really annoyed that it was 15 when it came out and my, my friend brought it round um, to watch and I thoroughly enjoyed it. It was a fantastic movie. It once was my favourite movie of the time but those, those films have surpassed that. Um, it's my 8th favourite film of all time I believe. Yeah, my 8th favourite film of all time. So that's Ted. Um, Number three is a film I saw in the cinema um, last year and I loved it. Um, best out of three. Um, I was so happy when I got this for Christmas. And it's Diary of a Wimpy Kid Three Dog Days. Let's press off the bureau, put here in two discs. So yeah, great, great movie. Best out of three, definitely recommend you check it out. So that's Diary of Wimpy Kid Three Dog Days. Number two is fantastic yeah. animation. Can't decide. Can't be quiet. Um, is a fantastic animation film. Um, it deserves to be at number two. Um, you have to love this film. If you don't even. If you don't even like it, then if you say you're a movie buff, you're not. It's the Pirates and an Adventure with Scientists. I love the movie so much, I have the Blu ray and the DVD. That's how much I love this movie. Just showcase off the Blu ray quickly. Over here. One disc and get it from Sony inside up. So, yeah, Pirates definitely recommend you pick that one up. Um, great film, just love it to bits. And my number one favourite film of 2011, I mean 2011, 2012, you're probably thinking I'm going to say Dark Knight Rises. I'm stupid saying this, but I've only seen Stop. Yeah. So I can't put it on this list, but some people will agree with me on this one. Because it's the best in the series. Um... And it is. I should have got the steel book, but it sold out. Skyfall. Yes. Skyfall is my number one pick for my favourite film of 2012. Just my favourite Bond film ever. I've only ever seen two out of the 23. I own um, Casino Royale, Quantum of Solace, and this one on Blu ray. Um, the Blu ray is stunning on this one. It really is. Um, oh, I just love this film. The way it's filmed, you know, it, it it's just great. Um, you know, push off the Blu-ray right quickly, and it's two discs, by the way. And yeah, you've got to love Skyfall. It's the best Bond movie ever. So yeah, guys, they're my top five picks for my top five favorite movies of 2011 so i'll go through it again um number 
Five being Skyfall. Num no. Number one being Skyfall. Number two being the Pirates in the Hall of Scientists. Number three being Diary of All Kid Dog Days. And number four being Ted. And number five being the Muppets. So yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, it was a stupid time to do it, I know, but hey ho, whatever's happened. What's happened's happened and there's no need to cry about it. So yeah. That's my picks. Um, so yeah, Blue Row Billy, looking off.